Rock the shades that Peter Chow wears today by visiting ShadySluts.com. Shades are only $34, and when you use my personal promo code PYROBOOBS, you will get $10 off. ShadySluts.com. Hello, Peter Chow here. And uh, today we're going to be frying a brain, doing one of these brain missions. Uh-oh. Not gonna do a prey mission like that. Uh-uh, that's a bad start. But uh, yeah, I believe that flying a plane is probably mostly the hardest thing that you can do in this game. But you know, today we're going to try to imagine what it's like to be a pirate. Alrighty, buckle your seatbelt everybody. Please turn off all your electronics. I would like you to welcome to the Peter Chow Airline. And uh, not to be confused with the oh take off. Sorry about that. You better, you better turn off your electronics because if you don't, I'm going to get my ass out of this pilot seat and I am going to come and kick your fucking ass. So turn your goddamn electronics off. There will be no use of cell phone, no use of anything. So you better turn all that shit off. You understand? And once we reach the appropriate altitude, at that point. Is the only point at which you can turn back on your electronics. But if you have any device that is using any data, it will interfere with us and cause us to crash. So you better turn that shit off before I lose my goddamn patience. You understand me? I'm Peter Chow and I'm the pirate of this flight. You will not use the laboratory until I can. I turn the goddamn lights off. They say that you can. Go to the laboratory and relieve yourself or have some sort of bowel movement or whatever you do in there. And by the way, I want to talk to some of you. Why do you go into the laboratory and piss all over the fucking floor? Do you, know, do you not know how to aim your penis? What's wrong with you? Is your dick, uh, you know, to the left or, or, or viewing to the right? Why don't you point it straight at the toilet and actually pee like that? Why do you have to do that to me? Huh? Why do you have to do that to me? Now, right now, we're going to be experiencing some turbulence because we're going to blow up some motherfucking bolts. So, calm down. Uh-oh, calm down. Sorry about that. Buckle your seatbelt right now. Now, of course, if the oxygen tank comes out, you're going to get, uh, you're going to kind of have to be gasping for air. But the thing is, is that up on the ceiling where the light is, it's going to be... Oh, shit, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm concentrating right now. Oh, no, missed it, missed it, missed it. Sorry about that. Buckle your seatbelt, buckle your seatbelt right now. What's going to happen is that the two things is going to drop out of the ceiling. And what you're going to do is you're going to help a child after you put it on yourself. So don't assist anybody until you have the oxygen mask on yourself. Because that is the safe thing to do. You understand me? You understand me? You better understand me. Uh-oh, I think I see them. I think I see them. Is that them right there? Oh, no! Crash landing, crash landing, crash landing. Speak to me, uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is Captain Chow speaking to you right now. And I must say, I'm so, uh, you know, uh, I, I'm a very inexperienced flyer. As the last plane that I flew, it uh, crash landing. I survived, but nobody else did. And uh, the thing is, is that I hope you can trust me still. I'm a very good pirate. It was just that one time that, you know, I mean, it, was, it, was, it, it wasn't my fault. It was the plane's fault. You understand? Which I'm sure will make you feel better. So hopefully, you will buckle your seatbelt. Uh, my airline, Peter Chow Airlines, is all about safety. So make sure to buckle up at all times. And if you do have to remove your seatbelt, don't fucking remove it. Because I certainly wouldn't, knowing that Peter Chow is the pirate. So keep that shit on unless you have to piss yourself. Because if you do have to piss yourself, wait until we reach an appropriate altitude before you do that. Because otherwise, if we experience any unexpected turbulence, you are going to fear it right up your bunghole. You know, you are going to fear it up your ass. That's what's going to happen. So, one other thing I would want to... Uh, to warn you about is turn off all your electronics because if your laptop 
uh, you got all that data shit going on, all those gimmicks. It's not gonna work, you know. And right now we're going into a deep dive, and we're gonna blow up some bolts. So make sure to plan accordingly. Oh yes, yeah. Sorry about that. A little bit turbulence. Uh, we got a little bit of bombing right here because I I didn't tell you, but Peter Chow Airlines is all about bombing other things that is pissing me off. And those boats, those were those boats were pissing me off. Uh, so we had to get rid of them. Hopefully that's okay. Uh, yeah, and uh, I just want to thank you for flying with the Peter Chow Airlines. We are good airline. You know, we're good. We're a good airline. So don't even think that we're bad because we're good. So don't tell all your friends at Air Canada and WestJet that Peter Chow Airlines is not a good airline. Because it is. I know that for a fact. Now, in case of an emergency landing, you're going to find two life vests under your seat. If we start drowning and you're not very good at swimming, I would suggest that you put that shit on. If you don't put that shit on, you're going to drown. And the cold water is actually very cold. So you might freeze from the hypothermia, you might just drown, not be able to breathe underwater and just die. Or, you know, you might just, you know, just, just, it will just be very, very uncomfortable, you know. Because the water is not heated. This is not a Hollywood movie in which when people drown, they're not actually drowning. They're actually just soaking in a very, very nice, lukewarm room temperature or something like that. So make sure to really, really, really think about safety first, okay? Uh, the next bombing will occur in the next two to three minutes. So I would like you to prepare yourself. So at this time, there will be no use of the laboratory. If you must get up to use the laboratory, then I would rather shit myself. Because right now, I'm now just going to blow up a plane. I'm blowing up a motherfucking chain. So, prepare accordingly, is all I have to say about that. Okay, here we go. We're approaching our target. Um, no, not approaching the target at all, actually. Uh, I would buckle up right now, because uh, right now we're experiencing a little bit of turbulence. We uh, overshot our target, so we're going to have to... <coughs> we're going to do that. Uh, again, this is your captain speaking. Uh, I am not qualified to be pirate, but I am anyway. But that's not the fucking point, you know. I got this job because I want the money. I fly planes for a living not because I'm good at it, but it's because I'm not, you know, the worst at it. I could be the worst after this. So I would like you to prepare for crash landing. Uh, because, oh, see, I overshot my target again. Ay, 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 oh, the planes, the planes. <laughs> Oh god, okay, here we go, here we go. Okay, shit, shit. Sorry about that, guys. I will really, really not use the laboratory at this moment. Okay, now we're on point. We are on point now. Okay, okay. Oh, crash landing! Crash landing, no problem. We All we need to do is we need to back out. We need to back out. Okay, uh, no. No, crash landing, crash landing! Hello, this is a Captain Charles Beaker. Uh, I am your pirate for the day. I have been uh, in two plane accidents before this. Hopefully that doesn't discourage you from, you know, traveling with us today. Uh, you, I uh, just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for uh, 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 flying. With Peter Chow Airlines, I am your pilot today. Did I mention that I was your pilot and I was in two previous plane accidents? Well, I was. So make sure to really keep that in your mind uh, before you decide to fly with us again. <laughs> so uh, yeah, Peter Chow Airlines right here today. I want to tell you that there will be no in-flight entertainment. Because honestly, the movies all suck anyway. So we don't want to pay an extra monthly fee to have all that shit playing on a goddamn flight. So guess what? Twiddle your thumbs, go to bed, take a nap, 
you know, honestly, I don't give a fuck what you do. But this is your captain speaking. And I you know, want to tell you that your safety is in good hands. Even though I am not, you know, don't have the best chat record, I, you know, okay, here we go. Sorry about that. I'm interrupting. Uh, important announcement. Oh, okay. I missed. Oh, no way. I didn't. Okay, I guess the bombs are good enough, huh? Anyway, uh, we're on to our second target. So, I would buckle your seatbelts again. We are on our way. I'm going to make a very unnecessary detour under the bridge. Wow! Wow! I feel like that's Star Wars right now. I feel like the Rebel, Rebel Fighter. What, what's that called? What's the What's the fucking thing that Luke Skywalker flies? The Rebel something? Rebel, Rebel the, you know, the orange white thing, the spaceship that he flies in the first Star Wars, that thing. No? Oh, uh, anyway, I, I don't know why I'm talking to you guys. I'm, I'm actually talking to my phone right now to record this. Uh, so I guess you guys can let me know in the penny section below what that's called. I, I believe it's called a Rebel Fighter. Maybe you use the, maybe I use the Wikipedia after this. Anyway, this is your captain speaking. Uh, we have reached the appropriate altitude. You can take a nap for now before our next bombing. And just sit back, you know, sit back, relax. Have a good time. Enjoy our lack of non-in-flight entertainment. Uh, our stewardess. Oh, sorry, I'm not supposed to call them stewardess. Our flight attendant will be um, right by to give you some soft drink. And by soft drink, I mean just raw, like lukewarm water because we can't fucking afford that shit. Okay. Peter Chow Airlines is all about economic saving. And you know, we're not gonna make any money if we serve you ginger ale. If we serve you Coca Cola. If we serve you Pepsi. No, we're not gonna do that shit. I don't care if you're parched. It's the goddamn, what's the fucking goddamn chain? Oh, you're, you're going the other way? Okay. Buckle up, motherfuckers. Be oh! Buckle up, motherfuckers. Fuck! Oh, sorry about that. We overshot again. Okay, we're back in business. Back in business today. Okay. Okay. And drop the bomb. Alrighty. <clears throat> sorry if you experience a little bit of that explosion. I cut it a little too close. But we're about to land now. So this is your captain speaking. The two bombings have been complete. And now I would like you to relax and enjoy the rest of the fright. Mm. Right That's right. Uh, we are doing very well. Relax. We're going to bring you to the landing airship field. So prepare yourself for landing. We're going to be landing shortly. Please put your seat back into the upright position. Because if you don't, the person behind you will be like, The fuck, okay? I got a goddamn seat in my face. And I'm feeling a little bit of uncomfortable. So if you would be ever so kind, put that shit down so we can land, you know? There's the up oh, there. There's the landing strip. We're going to take a little detour so we can kind of go in a little bit more straight. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Oh. 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 Okay. Okay. Oh. 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 Okay. Okay. Here we go. Crash landing. Crash landing. Here we go. Prepare to land. Prepare to land. No. Sorry about that. Overshot that shit by a mile or two. We're going to make a little bit of detour. And then we're going to be right back in this thing. Uh, I am not, I don't, I, I just want to let everybody ride in the flying with the air, uh, 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 the Peter Chow Airlines. I want to let you know I do not have a good track record with the landing. 
So please be patient. Oh, you see, overshot it again. We're going to need to fly back around. We're going to fly back around. We're going to go and take a little detour because you guys, you need, you guys need some scenery in your life, okay? So uh, we're going to go back. We're going to turn around. Oh, look, it's my house. It's my house. Can you spot your house? Oh, let's have fun. Okay, we're good now. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, we're in good position. I, I've never landed a plane at, at night time. Hopefully that thing makes you feel a little bit more comfortable. Okay, looks like this is going to be a good one, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, whoa. Okay, you see? Okay, I seem to be stuck a little bit. It's okay. Here we go. I'm stuck. I'm stuck again. Okay. 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 We're all good. Okay. Safe landing. Yay. Okay. Thank you very much for flying with Air Canada. Sorry, not Air Canada. Uh, uh, flying with Peter Tao Airlines. Uh, hope you enjoyed your flight. Sorry for the bumpy ride. Uh, please don't fill out the review cards and the recommendation cards because it's going to make me look like a shit. Like I can't fucking fly a plane. So I just want to let you know that I'm qualified. Okay, you may now turn on your cell phones. Turn on your cell phones. And uh, yeah, have a good day. Thank you for flying with uh, Peter Chow Airlines. Hope you uh, enjoy the time that you had flying with us. Bye! Whee! So that was fun. That took me only about three times. Um, but did it. You know, sometimes, sometimes you just have to do it, right? Anyway, I want you to take a look at my suit. Huh? You like that suit? And then look at, look at my hair. I have the mullet. It's more of a scarlet actually. I've uh, filled up the beard. I've grown it out a little bit. Mm, I'm playing with it a little. Oh my god. Did I just sniff my fingers? Yeah. I penetrated my asshole with my finger. Gave myself the asshole finger. And uh, yeah. Now I'm good. So let's do just. Let's do something for about. I don't know, the next five minutes, just just to fuck around, you know, just to fuck around. Oh yeah, let's fuck with this guy right here. You are you on the same car as me? Where'd you get your car? Where'd you get your car? How did you get it from somebody that I know? Do we get in the same dealership? Get your ass out of the car, please. I wanna fight. Oh my god, no, no, no. Oh shit. Oh, ah, ah, ah. Fucking Superman punch your ass! Huh? You shoot me? I just want to fucking fist fight you want to shoot me, you little bitch! You little bitch! You fucking bitch! Oh, I'm gonna blow your fucking face off! Okay. Enough raging, okay? You, you, you got blood on my goddamn suit! What am I supposed to do now? Am I supposed to do something? Huh? I have to go to the T, so I'm going to drive to the T, and then you can tune in into the next episode to see what Peter Chow is up to. Thank you for being patient with me as I failed all my flying missions. Oh shit, look at me. I don't even know the fucking time. But I blame that for me just getting out of the plane, so I'm, I'm used to those settings. You know what I'm talking about? Whoa, sunny! I have to get to T and it's all the way on the other side, so that's not going to be fun to get to. Whoa! Oh, there's a bridge! There's a bridge! I will get to that bridge too. Uh, Whoa! Look at that jump! Look at that jump! Are you jealous or what? Whoa! Here we go! Oh shit! Well, the next time you decide to join me for another edition of me 
fucking up and not knowing how to drive a car after landing a goddamn plane, which took me three fucking times before I could do it. Well, join. You know where to go. You go to the Grand Theft Auto V playlist mm -hmm. on the Peter Chow Games channel. Pause that shit. On the Peter Chow Games channel, you hit that subscribe button. You're on this video right now. You boom, give it a thumbs up so you can share with all your goddamn friends. So they come to this video, they watch it and go, fuck, this is funny. I don't even care if he sucks at the game. This is not about the game. This is not about whether he is good or bad at the game. It's about him being fucking so funny and irreverent. Understand? You thought your computer froze. It didn't. I just stopped talking because I was trying to process what I was going to say next. The shades that I'm wearing, ShadySluts.com. You buy your own pair and guess what? You use the promo code PYROBOOBS, P-Y-R-O-B-O-O-B-S, and you save $10. That's $10 off your purchase. Is that not the best fucking thing that could ever happen to anybody wanting a pair of sunglasses? And I realize that fall and winter is upon us. But that doesn't mean the sun is going anywhere. It's going to be cold as fuck. But the sun is still going to be there and you're going to need sunglasses if you want to drive safely. So go to ShadySluts.com. Buy your shades. Use the promo code. Tell your friends about ShadySluts.com and the palm promo code. And yeah, buy them. And watch all my Grand Theft Auto videos by subscribing. Do my Peter Chow Games gaming channel, and before I repeat myself for the third fucking time, I am going to bid you adieu and stop drinking the haterade and start drinking the bubble tea. Say hello to the camera. Uh, hello, how are you? How are you doing? How are you doing? Get out of here. Chow outside, motherfucker. Rock the shades that Peter Chow wears today by visiting ShadySluts.com. Shades are only $34, and when you use my personal promo code PYROBOOBS, you will get $10 off. ShadySluts.com.